Welcome to More Than Crypto, where we go beyond the digital coin chatter to give you a well-rounded financial edge. Today, we're embarking on a journey to uncover the art of finding reliable sources of information for crypto investing. In the fast-paced world of digital currencies, the sheer volume of information can be overwhelming. Yet, having a reliable compass to navigate this ocean of data is crucial. The digital age has bestowed upon us an abundance of information, but like a double-edged sword, it's both a blessing and a curse. The key lies in being able to distinguish the wheat from the chaff. This is especially true for crypto investing, where the stakes are high and misinformation can lead to significant losses. So how do you find trustworthy information? Well, it's a bit like panning for gold. It requires patience, time, and a keen eye for detail. Remember, information is as valuable as currency, and sifting through it is like panning for gold. First, consider the who. Who is sharing the information? Is it a seasoned analyst who's been in the game for decades? Or is it a new age social media influencer who's mastered the art of getting clicks and likes? It's important to understand who's behind the information you're consuming. After all, in this digital gold rush of ours, it's not just about finding nuggets of wisdom, but also about sifting out the digital fool's gold. Now, let's dive a bit deeper. What's the incentive of the person sharing this information? Are they genuinely trying to educate and share their insights, or are they pushing a narrative to benefit themselves? Perhaps they're promoting a specific coin they've heavily invested in, or maybe they're trying to drive traffic to their website or channel. Regardless of the motive, it's crucial to understand the why behind the who. Next, consider their investment strategy. Are they risk-loving crypto enthusiasts, or do they lean towards a more conservative approach like dividend collecting? It's essential to understand this because their strategy will inevitably color the information they provide. Let's illustrate this point. A crypto enthusiast might downplay the stability that comes with investing in blue chip stocks, while a conservative bond investor might not even consider the high volatility of digital currencies. It's like viewing the world through different lenses. Each investor sees the market from their unique perspective, and their advice will reflect that viewpoint. In the world of investing, understanding the source of your information is as important as the information itself. Just like you wouldn't blindly follow a stranger's directions, you shouldn't blindly follow investment advice without knowing who it's coming from, what their motives might be, and how their investment strategy aligns with yours. So let's remember, information is a double-edged sword. It can guide us towards financial prosperity or lead us down a path of financial missteps. The key lies in understanding the source's incentive. Are they looking to educate or are they pushing a narrative to line their own pockets? Investment time horizon is another critical factor to consider. This refers to the length of time an investor plans to hold on to their investment before selling it. Now, some investors are marathon runners, opting for a long-term approach. They're patient, allowing their investments to mature over several years or even decades. Their advice often revolves around stability and consistent growth. On the other hand, we have sprinters, the short-term investors, often day traders, who buy and sell assets within quick intervals. They thrive on market volatility, seeking to profit from short-term fluctuations in price. Their advice might be more about timing the market and capitalizing on trends. But here's the kicker. The right investment time horizon for you depends on your own financial goals and risk tolerance. A marathon runner's investment might not suit a sprinter, and vice versa. Ensure their timeline aligns with yours. After all, advice from a day trader will be vastly different from that of a retiree seeking steady income. Now dissect the investment idea itself. How is it structured? This isn't a trivial question. The structure of an investment can tell you a lot about its potential risks and rewards. Is it a single coin? A real-world business that is tokenized? A DeFi platform offering yields? or maybe an ETF that tracks on crypto. Each of these has its own unique characteristics and fits differently into a well-rounded portfolio. For instance, a single crypto can offer high rewards if the underlying use case performs well. However, it also carries significant risk because your investment is tied to the fortunes of just one entity. On the other hand, an ETF offers inherent diversification 
because they spread your investment across multiple cryptos, industries, or even asset classes. This can help mitigate the risk, but it also often means more modest returns. Now let's consider the investment strategy. Is it based on growth, where the expectation is that the crypto will increase in value over time? Or is it an income-focused investment, like DeFi projects with yields or a profit-sharing tokenized business designed to provide a steady stream of income? Each of these strategies has its place. Growth investments can be exciting, often associated with newer, fast-growing companies. But they can also be volatile, with significant ups and downs. Income investments, meanwhile, are generally more stable, but they may not offer the same potential for high returns. And finally, remember that the structure of the investment is only one piece of the puzzle. It's equally important to consider your own financial goals, risk tolerance and investment timeline. An investment that's perfect for one person might be entirely wrong for another. Understanding the structure of the investment is key to gauging its potential place in your portfolio. So scrutinize it, understand it, and only then decide if it's right for you. Remember, there's no one-size-fits-all in investing. Your portfolio should be as unique as you are. Consider the position size. Are we talking about a full-on leap or a tentative toe dip? Now, this is where we delve into the heart of smart investing, diversification and risk management. In the world of investing, there's an old adage, don't put all your eggs in one basket. This, my friends, is the essence of diversification. It means spreading your investments across various asset classes, sectors and use cases. This strategy helps you balance the risk and reward by allocating your investments in different areas that could each react differently to the same event. So why diversify? Well, it's all about managing risk. Imagine if you invested all your money in one crypto and that project gets hacked. You'd lose everything. But if your investments are spread out, the poor performance of a single investment is likely to be offset by the better performance of others. Now let's talk about overexposure. It's like having too much of a good thing. Yes, a hot crypto or a booming sector can be tempting, but loading up your portfolio with too much of it can be risky. If that crypto or sector takes a hit, your portfolio will take a bigger hit too. And here's another thing to remember. Diversification is not just about having different investments. It's about having investments that behave differently. You want assets that will rise when others fall and vice versa. This way, any losses on one side could be balanced by gains on the other. But remember, diversification is not a one-size-fits-all strategy. It should be tailored to your individual financial goals, risk tolerance and investment horizon. So take the time to understand your own investment profile before you dive in and get professional help if you need it. And let's not forget, diversification is not a set it and forget it strategy. It requires regular reviews and rebalancing as market conditions change. So to wrap up this scene, let's revisit our opening statement. Whether you're taking a full on leap or a tentative toe dip into investing, remember diversification is your shield against market volatility. Lastly, Consider whether this investment fits not just in your portfolio, but in your life. Every investor has a unique risk tolerance, a one-of-a-kind financial blueprint, and a comfort level that is wholly their own. It's essential to find investments that align with these personal factors. Think about your risk tolerance. Are you a daredevil ready to ride the roller coaster of high-risk, high-reward investments? Or do you prefer the steady, predictable path of low-risk options? Next, consider your financial goals. Are you investing for short-term gains or are you building a nest egg for a comfortable retirement? Your goals will determine the types of investments that are right for you. Finally, there's the sleep at night factor. Ultimately, your investments should not keep you awake with worry. If they do, they may not be the right fit for you. Does it match your risk tolerance, your financial goals and your sleep at night factor? In the pursuit of information, consider a mix of sources. This phrase isn't just a clever quip. It's a mantra for the modern investor. Today's digital age offers a wealth of information outlets, each with its unique perspective and insights. This can often be overwhelming for new investors. Established financial news sites are a staple, providing real-time market updates, expert analysis and economic forecasts, but they're also pushing their own agenda. 
These sites often provide a broad overview of market trends, making them an invaluable tool for both new and seasoned investors alike. One thing to remember is that if it's in the news, you're probably already late to the party. For more in-depth analysis, project white papers, insider information, industry experts, community channels, and official reports offer rigorous, detail-oriented perspectives. These sources are often grounded in research and offer a more analytical view of market trends. But let's not forget the modern wisdom found in podcasts, investor forums, and yes, even YouTube channels like ours. These platforms offer a more personal, conversational take on investing, often sharing real-world experiences and practical tips as long as you vet the content with a critical mind. Here at More Than Crypto, while we love the blockchain buzz, we advocate a holistic approach to investing. This journey we've embarked upon today has led us through the labyrinth of information sources available to investors. We've learned to scrutinize the credibility of our sources, to align our investment decisions with our time horizons, and to dissect investment ideas with a discerning eye. We've also underscored the importance of diversification and risk management, and the necessity of ensuring an investment fits not just our portfolios, but our lives. We've recognized that wisdom lies in a balanced blend of information sources, from traditional financial news to modern podcasts and forums. The power of information in crypto investing is undeniable, but let's not forget, this power is only harnessed when it's paired with wisdom. So keep learning, keep evaluating, and invest wisely. That's the more than crypto way. Before we part, remember, information is power, but only when paired with wisdom. Keep learning, keep evaluating, and invest wisely. If you need help with your investment journey, reach out to us at excellenceconsulting.co. We've helped thousands of crypto investors, companies, and even countries develop their crypto strategies. Stay tuned for more tips and insights. Thanks kindly for listening to the end and stay safe out there while sailing on the crypto oceans.